so last I left you guys, I had just accepted the application or the request to be approved and allowed into market in Atlanta for their wholesale show. So yeah, I was like a week and a half, two weeks before market would start. I had no idea what I was doing. I had, I had only been to market on a stationary platform and then also as the importer's designer. And so I didn't really know the background end of how things work at market and goodness gracious, that's a whole nother set of videos that I'd be happy to share in the future. But it is very, very in depth and detailed. And when you don't know what you're doing, you really don't know what you're doing but it was a lot of fun to learn. So I went on ahead and signed up and all that they had was like the back side of, there's basically on this whole entire floor, there's like a, a bathroom that takes up a square essentially in that floor. There's a couple of them, but this one in particular takes up a square. So there's like a men's side and a women's side and all of the activity is happening out here. And this square is here and there's one row behind it with one row of booths. And then that's it. Like that's the farthest exterior wall. Well, my very first time at market, I was on the back side of the bathroom square, which is so ridiculous. It's like the most ridiculous spot to have to be in, but it taught me so much. And I was eternally grateful for getting in that spot because what they actually sold to me was a three feet deep, but by 20 foot wide wall. And I could go up the wall as high as I wanted, but I could only come out into the walkway three feet, but I had the full 20 feet wide. And I set up my pallet wall with zip ties and that allowed me to then screw into the wall and be able to hang all my artwork. I had my little chair. I had a little box with like a order form that we just generated on like Excel spreadsheet or something like that. Again, knew nothing about anything. I'm not even sure if I had a paying device. I might've had a square at that point because of going to festivals. Um, so yeah, I'm pretty sure I had a square, but like that was it. Nobody, I had never really investigated the best way to display or how to promote your product while you're there or like what other stuff. So because I like to merchandise, I brought all this stuff that I wasn't actually selling to include to make my art look like it could be, you know, you tell people how to use it. And so I would set up these little vignettes and everything and people, I don't think were exactly sure what they were buying when they would first walk up to my booth, if they were buying my artwork or if they were buying the things that were in the vignette. But you know, you live and you learn. But at that show, I actually picked up like 35 new wholesale accounts and I had never done that much in business before all at one time. Now, granted it's wholesale, so it's not the full amount that you get when you do retail, but it was like shocking to me and it was such a crazy experience. And like, it just, there was, it was just invigorating because all these people are there and then you would make a sale and you'd be so excited. And then it looked like a, a frenzy, like sharks all of a sudden every now and then because three or four different shops would be standing there and all of a sudden people were like, oh, what's happening there? And it would just look so exciting to everybody. And it was so exciting to have a product that people just were clamoring and lining up to order and buy. Anyway, it was very fun and it taught me so much about market. And I did, I think I participated in total in, um, uh, 16 market shows actually always bringing my angels and crosses and whatever seasonal items I had, whether it be for Easter or Valentine's or 4th of July even. And then Christmas of course was huge. And I, I just, I, it was always a great experience. I learned so much over time in so many different ways. And it was such crazy growth for me that just happened organically and fell in my lap, but it was kind of exactly what people needed at that time. And so it worked really well. And, um, and it was a whole lot of fun. And I eventually got to where I was juried into being on the front row, which you have to apply for and you have to be juried in. So I eventually got juried in for that and did all kind of new things like different types of booth designs that they had never used before and all, all kinds of different things. So it was just such an amazing experience for the nine and a half years, I believe that I did it. And um, just lots and lots of fun. And I do recommend it to anyone, but like I said, I'll do some videos in the future with pointers if you decide to go to market. Ask some questions. Happy to talk about it. Thanks guys for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. And if you have any requests or questions, please comment below. And again, thanks for spending time with me today and take care.